Uh, this video is about a Sylvania Road Star. Road Star, actually, it's quite weird. So, we're going to energize this. This is just a bin find and it's in very good condition. Uh, the base load on my metering setup is 8.7 watts. So, don't worry about it. This is a polyphase meter put in three calls in parallel in a single phase meter. Um, that's a high speed meter and I use that meter because I've got two decimals. So don't worry about the 8.7. So whatever we measure today is going to be subtracted with 8.7. So this unit was in good condition. I'm going to energize it and we'll see what happens. It's an older bulb in there and I've got black on the ends. Um, so it's probably on the way out. But we'll give it a shot. The load is 87 watts at the moment. 150 watt bulb. Give you a quick glimpse. That's the startup current wattage. It's slowly increasing as the lamp warms up. The current increases and uh, it will uh, get brighter. We're at up to 90 watts. It's pretty quick restriking for an HPS high pressure sodium. 95 watts. I have another close look on the meter. I'll do this in one uh, rough shot. So we have 100 watts. It's a 150 watt lamp. So um, it should go up to about 150 watts. I may have to desync de my camera on 100 hertz so we don't get the lines. We will see how well we go today. Rodalco 2007 of course. And uh, we're sitting at 112 watts. I'll put my camera on manual. Stand by. Put the shutter on 100, 1 over 100, and then you get rid of the lines with the 50 hertz frequency we have in New Zealand. Uh, we're acquiring more power, we're up to uh, 130, 140 watts now. Meter's going faster, so the lamp is attaining more brightness. And I'll be de energizing the lights in the workshop shortly, and then uh, can enjoy it a bit better. 150 watts, 1.09 ampere, subtract the 8 watts off, so we'll see uh, what brightness we're going to get, and then we'll have a look again on the meter here, 158, so now we're at 150 watts full power on this lamp, and this is on the 1333 RPM meter, and this is on the 6, uh, or the 2 decimal meter, so it turns the other way, and it's in a very old meter, so... Of course, you got the camera focusing, so I de energize the lights and we'll see how bright the light is. So the Roadstar is running at 174 watts. It's nice and bright, the camera doesn't do it justice. But it's fine, the lamp works. So I'll show you the watt meter again, and we are at 175 watts. 0 0.96 ampere, just on the 1 ampere, so the power factor improved a bit to so 234 volts. And the meter are happy. Can't beat HPS. So much better than LED crap. I think the road stars are also called uh, Cobra heads. I think might be wrong with it. And I'll show you the internal of the device shortly when we de-energize the capsule. So we're going to let this lamp stew for a while and uh, see how well it performs. So we're sitting at. Uh, 180 watts and the meter is at 0 0.0809 that's at about 0.5 almost and uh, that's this one so we have these readings as reference points so I'll let this cook for a while. You know bin of treasures I found another cool street light this is a uh, ground one looks looks almost like a ship lamp uh, it looks pretty good. I can't see any make on it, but I uh, will analyze it. Just the wire has been cut off. Not sure if it works, but I like it. It's very cool, so I'm going to open it up and document the device and see if I can get it to work. Look at this in front of the roadster. Oh, that looks really nice. I love these lenses. Let me see some more. There's some more on the skip. Uh, the roadster is settled. Uh, 170 minus 8, 162 watts. So the pre-ignition ballast uses about 12 watts and these meters are happy. 
and the other meter sits here to spinning and uh, yeah it's a long way around but it's warm the heat normally rises into the heat sink but it's uh yeah, the lens is quite happy there very cool Shot of one over two thousand. Gonna do a de-energization on this uh, roadster to show the afterglow. I'm warm at the one to restrike. I think now I will try to restrike it. It won't happen. This is just a test. Oh, it's coming back on pretty quick. That is just a quick restrike, because it's dropped off a bit, and the meter's sitting on these readings here. I'm just going to open it up and uh, show the inside. The energy device. It's a big unit in my hand. It's pretty big. Okay, we're going to open this device up, have a quick look inside. These are the standard click uh, domes, squeeze, and they pop out. Take the electrical uh, receptor off. It's also marked Roadstar. Roadstar actually is the correct word. And um, looks pretty good inside. Put temporary wiring on, so this is the igniter. And uh, that part was populated for a photo cell, but it's, I haven't used it, that's alright. Here's the condenser or the capacitor for the power factor correction. And a fused uh, insert part. It is hard to get out sometimes. It probably should be five. There could be anything in there. Ten ampere, a bit too much, but that's all right. So then it can stay in there. And this is the nameplate. Sylvania Roadster PR4211NZ T150. 240 volts, 50 hertz, 0.78 ampere. Made in Australia. So it's quite a significant lamp, it's a good lamp. And it's going to head up to, uh, I think, Napier or somewhere. Let's see what happens. So this is the final readings for the meter at the moment. Cool. Now the lamp is from uh, the first month, so January 09. These covers are even recyclable there, this uh, number 2 plastic. And just the patent, it's on the, on the cover, on the rear of the cover. And here at the front side, this uh, receptacle can be populated as a photo cell, can go in here. They haven't connected it up, but um, that can be put in. Because these road stars are usually controlled from a, a Montrose box with metering point and uh, a contactor and a photo cell on the side. Yeah. There's one color you can't beat, that is this low pressure sodium. This is the best color you can imagine. This is still the best color. This is, I don't know, lamp. Diffusers are so amazing. Simply stunning. Put some music on this. Now I'll shut up and we'll get the notes. Let's have this music on. We'll do it. Let's see if it's still doing looks.
No, no, no. Sixty-two watts. Or minus eight is actually uh, fifty-four. The sodium is on full power now, so uh, when you said it's running for all, I'll just edit into the Roadstar video. Just the colors are just all uh, amazing on these devices. Need to have a clean up here, but uh, it doesn't seem to happen that quick, so there's a lot of junk floating around here. I can still move around, so that's the important part. Yeah. Sweet ass.